What's up, guys? We are here testing some Explorer slash Pioneer decks in order to pick a deck for the upcoming RCQ season. We're trying to get an invite to Edmonton here in the west of Canada. And today we're going to be running through some decks to kind of test what it's all about, how it feels to play, which one we want to sleeve up for the upcoming paper tournament. Our first deck on the docket is Is It Phoenix? It's a little bit of a shifted version of it because we don't have Delve on Arena and we don't have Charms on Arena uh, to kind of big cards that are in this deck that we've had to replace with some things um so let's run down the deck we've got a lot of one drops we've got um some mdfcs we've got some discard damage uh we've got spell mastery damage a little bit of control with stuff like um one spell pierce we used to have some other things in here so um, we've replaced one of our ops with an otherworldly gaze so that we can dump a bunch of stuff into our graveyard. We've got considers for draw, charter course for draw, ledger shredder for conniving. Um, something in the ice, just in case we need to play a blocker or something that can overtake a board in the Awoken Horror. We've got some galvanic iterations for duplicating spells. Um, some pieces of the puzzle for getting, again, those phoenixes into the graveyard and also drawing some uh, instants and sorceries. We've replaced our Delve um, Treasure Cruise with Thirst for Discovery. It's the only real draw three on Arena that's sort of free. Uh, the discard outlet also helps with the Phoenix deck. And then we've got Prismari Command instead of our Is It Charms um, this is as close as you can get to an Is It Charm on Arena. The only big difference is that, one, this helps you destroy artifacts and creates treasure tokens, uh, but also it's one mana more, so it's a little bit more expensive to cast, but it's, again, as close as we can get to that Is It Charm on Arena. And then, of course, for Phoenixes, we, the game plan is to dump these into our graveyard, cast a bunch of things, and bring them out with haste and deal a bunch of face damage. Our sideboard is pretty standard. We've got extra lightning axes. We've got a braids for those heavy artifact matchups. We've got a disallow for, you know, just in case we run across an Atraxa, basically... Competitive formats these days are who can build the best Atraxa frame. We've got some Crackling Drakes just in case we need more bodies. Crackling Drake is great because it counts instants and sorceries in your graveyard as well as in Exile. So if you are using those Delve cards, uh, which we're not in this particular build, but um, Crackling Drake is going to continue to count those. So that's why you choose Crackling Drake over something uh, like Haughty Jin. Uh, we've got Invasive Surgery to remove something from our player's deck. We've got some Rending Volleys to slot in against those white or blue matchups. Mystical Disputes to slot in against those blue matchups. And then Brothers End to slot in against both the heavy artifact matchups, but also the like mono white, go wide, um, tiny dorks matchups. Now we've got a Hallbreaker Horror in here, which is a really great card because we're casting a lot of spells, uh, but also it does not get bounced by a thing in the ice. So if you need one big body to kind of shore up a late game, we're not looking to go late game, but if you need to go late game, if you're playing against a dirtily deck that's controlling you a bunch, uh, Hallbreaker Horror is a great thing to slot in uh, with the thing in the ice plays so that you can push the board and not lose your big giant creature uh we're gonna do some best of threes so let's jump in and see how they go hello how are you nice to see you or not see you nice to hear from you hope all is well uh so let's jump into some alchemy best of three Not alchemy, sorry. Explorer, best of three.
The Is It Phoenix deck is kind of the first time I've really explored outside of or with red at all, other than a little bit of splash in Grixis decks for standard. But um, from what I've played of it so far, I really liked it. It's just more aggressive than and just aggressive than I would like. Currently, if I had to pick a random tier order for these three decks that we're testing today, I would say Is It Phoenix is in third place, uh, followed by Demir Control in second and Rogues in first. Oh, we get to choose. Uh, we'll be on the play. Three cliffs. That's not good. Two cliffs, also not good. Uh, okay. We are going to throw away a hazard, I think. Not great draws, not great options so far, but we're playing against Mono Blue Spirits. All right. So I think our play is to Ledger Shredder here. Damn, uh, no blocks. Um, okay, I think we counter target spell. I think we just eat up some damage for a minute. Next turn, we can Lightning Axe ship the Spike Field Hazard. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll decline to take an extra two when I don't need to. Pieces of the puzzle. They can sacrifice it to counter the spell, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter to me. We got rid of it either way. I just wish I had a better thing to throw out other than my spike field hazard. Faceless Haven. Do I want to take eight? a 4-3, but it's also all creatures. Okay. We get a phoenix. Uh, I'm going to decline and discard uh, these two. Oh. Okay. Um, so we want to bring in our mystical disputes. We want to bring in our volleys. And we'll bring in one a braid. Um, 
some spell pierce. We'll get rid of one iteration and we'll get rid of I like impulse here. Actually, let's get rid of two or one hazard. Yeah, let's do that. We'll bring in those white blue damage spells. And the blue counter. Our opening hand is Cliffs, Impulse, a Braid, Thing in the Ice. I don't hate this. It's not great, but we can play it. We draw a Phoenix, which is not my favorite. Next turn, we can Thing in the Ice or a Braid. Thirst for Discovery is good. That'll help us get rid of our Phoenix. Um, red. Thirst for Discovery. Okay. Okay. They brought in their dispute, so we gotta keep an eye out for that obsession. Great. They're gonna draw. Field four, draw a card. We get a Prismari command. We have three open. I really want to get the Phoenix into the graveyard before I do this, but. I pay two. I'm just going to cast this third one just so I can flip my thing. Just so I can flip the dang thing. They're on a two turn clock now. Hey, okay. All right. They were not effing around. They were not. Okay, we are going to be on the draw. Opponent goes first. Sure. Swift water into. Are we playing another spirits deck? No, it's 
just islands, so... Well, let's give him a chance to counter. Sure. Sure. We drew a... S okay. They are leaving the mana up again. Hmm. I mean, we can just pieces of the puzzle, see if they Oh, they didn't counter. Okay. Let's take um, a charter course and an opt. Okay. So now we can play Shredder and pay if they force us to. Oh, okay. Just straight up blue control. Let's end turn. Scry one draw. I do not want a swift water cliffs. I don't want a fiery impulse either. Um, okay. What do we try first? Charter course? Let's keep spell pierce. Oh, Momo, hello. Fading hope, sure. Sure. You have a question. Is it about me, perhaps? Hiring you for your services. Oh, perfect target. Okay, let's lightning axe. Look at this stack. Um,
Sure. Audi Jin again, okay. Actually, you know what? I'll take that consider. Just straight up blue. Straight up blue, huh? I think we're okay here. We're not worried about bodies. We're just really worried about their counter spells. They probably have a full sideboard of mystical disputes. Swift what one land, two land. Um, okay. Turn two, I can mystical dispute something if they play it. Um, okay, we can play that.
Sí. My turn, we draw a... Consider... So we can just chart a course. <clears throat> Show you. Have your consider. They bin make disappear. Okay. Draw yet another land. Interesting. They play a terror, sure. What is it? Ward two. I forgot I would have to pay for the ward twice. Galvanic iteration and then consider bin draw Two cards, okay. spells have I cast this turn? <sighs> mm. 
not enough, apparently. We draw a... Okay. So we're going to... Lightning Axe... Discard my land. Pay for that. We're going to gaze. Hey! Alright, that was an interesting matchup. I don't know. I don't know that mono blue tempo is good in this format. A strange deck to come up against. Uh, okay, one more. One more. Sweaty. Hello. Oh, an Urabrask avatar. Eh? Lost the die roll. Good. Two ops, but it's not a terrible start. They mulligan to six, play Hall of Storm Giants. We draw a simple is land. Consider on end of turn. else they play island again shredder okay um all right I, I think we play that and this discard an opt and then we can opt on end of turn chart of course Another shredder. Okay. They missed a land drop, which is good for us. We get another lightning axe. Okay. We draw a pieces of the puzzle. I'm going to throw out a thirst for discovery. pieces of the puzzle they missed another land drop oh no hopefully they had one on the top there hey they got it okay um okay so let's pieces of the puzzle Sure. 
They play strategic planning. Okay. Okay. They're also playing Phoenix. So if we consider end of turn and find a land, are we keeping it? Another strategic planning, okay. Oh, nice. A tap land. Sure. No land. Okay. Um. So I think we're still just setting up for a further turn. We'll take a consider and an impulse. Oh, did we play a land? Yeah, we played a swift water cliffs. Okay. Uh huh. Next turn we can sp Oh, we can't lightning axe. Damn it. We should have taken that opt. Iteration is one. Consider is two. We got a phoenix on the board. They have one in the bin. Chart, of course. Okay. Discard a phoenix. Got it. Play a land. Okay, that's spell number two. So they have two phoenixes in the board. Okay. So I'm taking six this turn. Yep. Yep. Uh, yep. My turn. We get a command. Okay. So we are going to Shredder. Then we are going to Impulse. Uh, 
Um, we really have no... Choose two up. Oh. Uh, deals two damage to any target. Target player draws two cards. Discard two? Oh, shoot. Uh, okay. So now we're kind of just playing the Phoenix game. They kill my shredder twice. Okay. They extra kill my shredder. Interesting. They throw out another Phoenix. Dang. Okay. Pieces of the puzzle. Okay. Take nine. What? Two, three. Shredder shredding. We will discard a card. only have the one phoenix in the bin oh did i just kill myself oh i guess they might not have it they have to play charter course they have to find another spell that i can jump block any day They could just have a spike field hazard too. Oh my god, they don't have it? I don't have it either. Full stalemate. <laughs> Okay. Sheesh. This is tense. Tense. Charter course. Okay. Draw two, then discard a card. 
Hopefully they don't draw two more spells. They threw out an opt, so they probably have it. That's two. Dang. Ledger Shredder does not count as a third. They messed up. Trade phoenixes, then I need to cast three spells. And I draw a ledger shredder. That's not gonna do it. Okay, move on. Moving on. Um. So I think we want to bring in the Brotherhood's End here. And the Crackling Drakes. Get rid of the Thirst. Bring in the Disputes. And the horror. Take out a pieces, take out a Actually, let's just take out the iterations. Let's just take out the iterations. Um yeah. I haven't played a ton of Is It Phoenix, but I think in my whole time testing it, I've never actually come across a mirror. Um, shoot. Okay. I guess we keep this because we have chart a course on two. And we have Storm Giants early, which is good. They put disputes. Yeah. Shoot. I walked right into that one. They also have a hall and they also have a shredder. Pulses. Aether Gust is actually really good in this mirror. Okay, bye. Thanks for stopping by. Don't do it. Fine. Next turn, we're going to get 
gaze. Okay, we'll gaze first. Sure. Consider. Should have Okay, I probably should have attacked the shredder when the connive popped another shredder sure Another counter. They do not. Okay. Okie dokie. Try to shredder. Okay, they don't have any counters. No disputes in hand. They could just have some burn spells. Another shredder, okay. Move to combat, no blocks. Take four. We draw a hazard. Okay, so let's gaze. Then charter course. Sure. Oh no, it tapped me weird. Um, okay, no. Dang it. Okay, I was not paying attention to how it tapped.
Do they have three spells? I mean, they're cycling through a lot right now, so most likely. They have just the one? Okay. We could do that. Dang it. I was not paying attention to my land. That was on me. That one's on me. We draw a chart, of course. I have to discard that. Oh, I should have discarded the Phoenix. What what am I doing? Three, six, ten. Chandra. Okay. Crackling Drake, sure. Get rid of the impulse. They're going to get rid of consider. 18 for Red shirt. Sure. What 
Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, create an elemental token. Okay. To cast three spells this turn. Twenty four four. Amazing. Yep. Dang. Okay. They floss their teeth with us. Okay, so that was our third game. We went two and one. Um, I thought it was pretty fun. I think that Fiz Is It Phoenix is a blast to play if you like um, kind of comboing off. Obviously, the paper slash online version is a little bit different because we don't have to have these commands or thirst for discoveries. We get the charm. We get the delve cards. Um, as far as sideboard stuff goes, I... I wish I had cast Brother's End instead of throwing out the Brother's End and I kept the Phoenix in my hand for some reason. Um... And I also was not paying enough attention to my current mana base on board. So I I feel like I slightly punted it, uh, but I didn't do too bad. I'm not a very seasoned Is It Phoenix player, so I think this deck is fun. I am going to continue playing it in paper, I think, but I'm not sure if this is going to be what I sleeve up for the upcoming RCQ. Uh, obviously, the land base is a little rough as well. Because I don't have all of the is it rare lands and whatnot. But um, in paper, I do. And in paper, the list is complete and looks really good. Yeah, I think it's fun. I highly suggest you try out the is it Phoenix deck in Pioneer, if you're into casting spells and comboing off, um, if you want to cast a bunch of things and deal a bunch of damage with haste, uh, definitely check this out. There is a, a version of this deck that has four thing in the ice. And I think that I like that. I think I would maybe swap out some things, um, some other cards for some more things. Um, but other than that, I think that this deck is really fun. Obviously, it's it's a long-standing deck in, in this format, and it used to be really popular in Standard. So there's been tons of iteration on it and some new cards coming in and out. I like it. I think I am going to keep this on my favorite list, and we're going to play it every now and then, but I don't think it's really my speed as much. Um, 
And I don't know if that's just the way red plays versus the way like black plays, but I definitely prefer my blue decks to have black in them. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube later, thank you so much for checking it out. Comment below. Tell me what you think of the deck, what you think of the list. Uh, do you play lots of Visit Phoenix? Let me know if I missed any lines or how to kind of adapt that. But thank you so much for checking this out and we'll catch you later. For those of you on Twitch, uh, I'm going to take a quick break, refill my coffee or water, and we'll jump